Choose the location on the panel where you'd like to display your pins. Avoid displaying the pins directly on top of the LEDs. Go ahead and push your pin through the panel. And again, avoid placing the pins directly on top of the LEDs or through the PCB board. After you download the Spotlight app, go ahead and open it. Go ahead and turn on your Dream Skin, and remember the code. Go ahead and click Connect to Device, and you'll see the Dream Skin appear. Go ahead and select it. Now the Dream Skin is connected. Go ahead and select the information in the top right corner, and let's go ahead and do it for more update. Go ahead and start the update. After the update finishes, your dream skin will restart. Now that the update is finished, we can go back to the main screen and we can reconnect to the dream skin. To load an animation, Select it from the main screen. Each animation has an adjustable speed and brightness. And then there's a download button that we can select to download to the skin. To load an animation from your camera roll, select the animation button and then select the camera roll icon. Now you can select the animation from your camera roll. Select Choose in the bottom right, and then the check mark at the top right. You can now orient the animation by rotating it 90 degrees. And using the squeeze and pinch, you can go ahead and make the animation larger or smaller, move it left or right, or up and down. Once it's in your desired location, go ahead and select the green check mark. You can also adjust the speed of this animation. And then you can download it to the Dream Skin to see how it looks. If no further adjustment is needed, you can go ahead and hit the Save icon and name your animation. You can also adjust the global brightness and speed by selecting the information icon top right and then going to hardware setup. The brightness is at top and I always like to set it around 20% and then the speed I'd like to put at 2. There's also an orientation for the text and I like to select the vertical. Again to the main screen. 
Now we'll go ahead and create an animation from an animation found on the internet. First thing you want to do is go to your browser. And once you find an animation that you like, you can go ahead and hold and save to your photos. Go back to the app, select animation, and then the animation icon, and select the animation you just downloaded. Select choose, the check mark at the top, and then rotate. Is the animation in the desired location? And then you can hit the green check. Again, you can also adjust the speed of this animation and then download it to the Dream Skin to see how it performs. Now you can save and name your animation. Although the Dream Skin has a physical on and off button, you can toggle on and off the Dream Skin using the light bulb at the top of the You can also import static images using the image button. This will open up the camera roll and you can select a static image. Again, using the pinch and squeeze feature, you can make the image bigger or smaller, whichever you prefer. Once the image is in the position you like, you can select the green check mark at the top right. You can further edit the image using the tools. As an example, I'll remove the white pixels in the corners of this image. I can enlarge the screen, and then I can move the canvas around. From the color palette, ensure you choose the color that you desire. I'll then select the edit tool, and then I will remove the pixels that I do not want. Once the image has been cleaned up, you can go ahead and download it to the Dream Skin. Static images also have dynamic effects. Choose the star wand and then choose the desired effect. You can also adjust the speed of that effect that it has on the image. With this image, I'll choose a laser and adjust the speed to the fastest setting. Once it looks good, you can save and name the image. If you've created images that you want to remove from your main screen, you can select it and hit the delete icon. Now we can create a playlist. Select playlist, and then hit the plus at the bottom left, and hit the plus, and we can add our animations. We can choose our animations, and then any images in the graffiti tab, and then the check mark at the top right. You can then choose how many times the animation plays before proceeding to the next animation in the playlist. Now we can save and name our playlist. To download a playlist to the Dream Skin, you can select the orange icon to the right of the playlist name. To delete a playlist, select the green trash can icon and confirm.
To edit the number of times an animation plays in your playlist, select the playlist and adjust accordingly. You can also delete animations from your playlist using the green trash can icon. You can also download and edit animations from the cloud. Select the icon in the middle bottom and scroll through the animations. When you find one that you like, select it and you can send it to the dream screen or you can download it. So edit each animation. Select the animation and hit the edit icon. Then you can select the frame and then you can use the tools to add to the animation, frame by frame. As you edit each frame, you can see your progress in the preview above. It's finished, you can select the save icon and download to the Dreamskin. Thank you for watching and can't wait to see everyone's creations at the upcoming festivals.